Hey guys, how's it going? It's your boy Captain Rico, and I'm going to be filling in for the Scarlet Raptors today, and we're going to be playing Dark Souls 3. Now, I wanted to do the boss speed challenge. Now, what that challenge is, is that you run around, and you pick a certain number of bosses that you want to fight in under a certain time limit, without dying, of course. And if you die, you lose the challenge, and your video series is over. So for me, I'm going to go fight the tutorial boss. And I'm going to go fight the uh, boss at the uh, High Wall of Gothric within under 10 minutes. So, as soon as we get to the graveyard, that's when the time will officially start. But, um, and also I will be cutting out any, like, like, you know, in-between scenes. So, like, you know, any loading screens, I'll cut those out. Yeah, as you guys can see, we're already like 10 seconds in, but you know what, that doesn't matter, because I'm going to kill all the bosses, no problem, without dying. Okay, you're dead. And you're dead. So yeah, I guess this is kind of like a, um, a speed run only, I'm doing it in multiple parts, so in the comments section, I want you guys to give me a time limit. And if you guys could, if you want to, you can research the bosses in the area. And I want you to give me a list of the ones you want me to beat in under a certain time. And I will do my best to beat them all in that time limit without dying. It's a personal challenge to me. I don't know if this thing really exists. But um, I'm going to try my best to tell you guys the most. Um, if I can tell you guys just... A little bit if you guys are really curious about playing this game is just just take your time i've been playing this game for a while so i know my way around i know how to dodge but that doesn't mean i can't die i'm not saying that you can still very easily die in this game if you underestimate a boss in this game it can get around you and kill you just like that this is uh, gun gear right here. He's the first boss I have to defeat. Um, also one of the other members of the Raptor Pack, uh, B Muffin Spins. He's going to be recording Dark Souls as well, and he's going to be showing you some from his point of view. He's not going to be doing the boss speed challenge, but he is going to be doing some co-op, and I'm going to be joining him on that, so stay tuned for those. So that's the first boss. He's dead. Alright, how are we doing on time? Uh, okay. We beat him in under three minutes. Mm, that's pretty good, I think. That's like the fastest I've ever really beaten him, I guess. Um, before, you know, I've, no, I've normally like been taking my time. I've really been trying to go for speed, but now... I am, so I feel like we can get to um, the next boss, no problem, and kill him in under 10 minutes. Even though he is like a, a much bigger foe, it doesn't really matter. He'll drop like all. Now there are going to be some bosses in this game that are going to be almost impossible not to die the first time to, but I'm going to do my best to not die to them. Uh, you know, I, I you know I wanted to upgrade with her, but that doesn't matter. I just wanted to upgrade my health. These doors are always so difficult to open. That it's so long. That's Lothar Castle right there. That's later in the game when we have to go find this, the Lord of Cinder, Prince Lothric. Um, we're gonna try to defeat him at some point. Uh, I don't exactly know how long it'll take me to defeat him. Definitely not in ten minutes. But we can always try. Ow. You can die. 
Thank you. Alright, a little bit more extra health would have helped, I guess. Yeah, those guys up, they just piled those guys up right there. Ow. I don't know, I'm always good at dodging those guys for some reason. I was not at that time. Everything's trying to chase me down, but... I will not fall. There's a little s speed jump right there. Just heal up. Oh, I caught my leg. You see the arrow sticking right out of my foot. See the arrow sticking right out of my foot right there. <laughs> Alright, so before we even head to the boss's room, which is right down those stairs, we're gonna go visit one lady. Her name is Emma. She's a nice lady. Ow. You poked me. This is the High Priestess right here. Her name's Emma. She's gonna give us a banner. And pretty much, she just made us part of the covenant called the Blue Sentinels. Well, not Sentinels, my bad. The, uh, the Way of the Blue. Pretty much, we're like, a, we're like a neutral party. We don't really come out to anybody's aid and, or anything. Now the blue sentinels, now if you were part of the way of the blue and you got invaded by somebody and you were part of the blue sentinels, you'd actually come to uh, save that person. So it's kind of like a shield and sword type of thing. Oops, I almost freaking out. Gotta put my lightning. I'm gonna run right underneath. The oh, nope. Or not. Ow. Stop it. Got him. Oh, I'm frostbitten. Oh, okay. Whatever. That doesn't matter. Yeah, I beat him. Alright, guys. This has been Captain Rico playing the um, boss speed challenge. Um, let me know down below, like, you know, how fast you guys want to see me beat the next set of bosses that are right off this clip cliff up here. Um, until then, I will talk to you later in the next video. Goodbye.